Hi folks, Mr. Mega Man fan here. Like, share, comment, and subscribe. You know all the things to do. It's time for another edition of Good Will Hunting. Got a few different things in here, starting with a Wii power supply and a component cable that was only $4.99. Actually, $4.99 for each of those items. But the real cherries are further down. If I keep going here, a five pack of CDRs for five bucks. I don't have anything that'll print a printable CDR, but I can just straight up record stuff on them. And this very nice looking Power A camouflage controller, not wireless, but I like the camo so much that I decided to get it anyway. All the buttons seem to be in good shape. The sticks aren't as worn out as you usually see with Goodwill Xbox controllers. Trust me, there were some in the bin that were far, far worse than this and no cracking or visible damage either. So I'm pretty happy with this and I'll try this at a future date. But the main event here the uh, big enchilada, if you will, is a Rev 101 black Nintendo Wii. Now you may be saying, Mr. Mega Man fan, you already got a black Wii in a previous video. Ah, but I will show you the difference. You see how the Wii logo is horizontally oriented as opposed to vertically? That's your first clue. Your second clue will be when you read the serial number it'll say rbl 101 no matter which region it is japan us whatever so for comparison i've gotten my previous goodwill black wii out and as you can see it's oriented vertically as opposed to horizontally here's the uh, side by side comparison see the difference you can also see on this older Wii that it has RBL001. So there's your difference between the two models. Anyway, I'm going to test the new Wii out. We're going to see if anything is in it or inside it. Any hidden games. And then we'll be done with today's video. Okay, so to get the maximum amount of fun out of this project, I've wired up the new Wii through a component switcher through the Retro Tink 4K. And if I did this all right on the first try, I'm going to be pretty pleased, but we have to turn on the TV and find out. Well, hot damn, to get it right. Okay, looks like it's probably been factory reset. a disc in here. Nope, please insert a disc. Is there an SD card in here? No, there is not. Over two. And if it's been factory reset, there's not going to be any save data on here. No. We have a blank slate here. Well, I suppose the least we should do is put a game in and make sure the drive works. Okay. Oh, I 
I can still jailbreak it later if I want to. But I'm gonna do what I have to do. It's not connecting to Wi-Fi right now, so this update is entirely on the disk itself. set up any Wi-Fi settings. So now it's going to reboot. There's our game. Let's go with Super Mario 2, that's a classic. It looks nice scaled up, I have to say, I'm liking how this looks. stupid. Revenge! Man! That's more like it. Oh, shit. Well, everything works. So, good enough for me. I'm Mr. Mega Man fan. Thanks for watching.